Um, just going to do a little review on this uh, the JTB batch editor. So what I have at the minute is I have a project here, which I'm sure everyone is familiar with. I'm working at, on at the minute, and uh, it just seems to be the one I'm working on for most of my videos. Uh, so if I go into the document manager, I want to remove, let's say, for example, I want to remove the project from the drawing. So if you go in, if we go in here, we can see there's a project name here. Let me go into MS1. So there's a project name here. So if I go into some of the later ones, I have removed the project name from the, my project settings. So these ones were created without the project name. So what I want to do is I want to go into these other ones and change the project product name, project names. So it's in all, all these MS for mesh. So just type in. So I purchased this from the App Store. It was ninety five dollars. Uh, I do believe it'll be worth it. It's not a one year thing. It's a continuous license, I believe. Uh, so what you want to do is add drawings. So go into the folder you're working with. Select the drawings you want to edit. Sorry, I'm yawning. It's like one o'clock in the morning here. Sorry, so I got to get the mesh drawings. So here, we'll open them all. So pick your drawings, add them, and it compiles them here. So now you can see part numbers, all these things. So here is your tokens. So I'll go into your tokens here. And if I go over to my project, I can see the ones that have the right name and the ones that don't have the right name. So if I want to change these, oh, I just got rid of that. Sorry about that. That won't speed me up any. So, JTB. All right, let's try it again. We'll try it one more time. This is so. Look, if I was going to change these, uh, the way I previously would do it would be open each drawing. So now all I have to do is go across here. I will click on this one. Let me copy that. Now there might be a faster way of doing this, but I've just I've just got this today, so I don't know if there is. I'm sure I'll find it out eventually. So uh, if I click on it three times, so or you can just type it in like this. So three times highlights everything. Uh, you know, no matter how slow I'm doing here for my first time, it's the faster and opening all the drawings. And okay, and then apply attribute changes. You can see it all working down there. Work pretty fast. Just come in here, go back to document manager. And go to details. And go to my MS1. And zoom in, and you can see that the project name has changed. Ah, so I do think already, just for that fact, over a year, ninety-five dollars is probably going to be worth it just to change a couple of tokens. Uh, some people may not think it's worth it. I do. Oh, sorry, I'm yawning again. Excuse me. All right, so that's my first review. I'll probably do another review later once I get to use it a little bit more. All right, take care. Bye-bye.